Okay, so this is the video that's going to show you how to install your key onto your keyboard. You can uh, start out by looking at the pieces that are around the uh, rubber cup here. You can see that um, there's a fitting all around and it has two holes here at the bottom in this case where uh, you can slide something right in. Uh, and then at the top corners there's also holes, but they're more of like caves. There's no specific um, point of entry for uh, the sticks that are on the plastic pieces. So make sure to look at your different keys because sometimes the caves that in this case are at the top corners, they can be at the bottom or even at the sides. So position for that uh, determines the positions for these pieces and what we're going to do now is click these three pieces together to make one piece and we start out with the large piece you can see that at the top it has one bar and at the bottom it has two bars also make sure not to put this whole piece upside down like this because it looks the same from from far away but uh, if you look if you feel um, the top of the side bars it's one smooth piece from top to bottom and in the bottom it kind of cuts like almost halfway through so if you feel that it, it's not one entire piece that faces the keyboard and the one piece faces away from the keyboard so now you know the position for that piece you put it down for now and you get the next piece which is this here and at the top it has one bar and at the bottom it has one larger bar and this is cut also but um you want to feel the um the top of the uh the sidebars here if you feel a gap there at the bottom of the uh the piece where the larger bar is that faces up and at the bottom the uh the the piece is cut closest to the uh thin bar here the top bar so now you know the position for that piece. What you do is put the uh, the black piece underneath the white piece, and you just put the uh, the top part right through the middle of the white piece like that. Then um, it has the black piece has two sticks that have to go into the fittings that are in the middle of the white piece. So we're just gonna separate both pieces right now like the, oh, we choose one side I usually do the left side first but you can do right or left so what you do is just you know um, separate the white piece from the black piece uh, so that the stick that's in the black piece can actually go in the hole that's in the white piece this is gonna take a few seconds because you know the pieces are just so close together and they're not very um, flexible. Okay, so we got that part in. Now you hold that part and you stretch the other part. And there you go. Now both pieces are one. You get the third piece, which is this. And you f it has like two kind of um, legs on it. So the gap faces uh, you know the keyboard and on top make sure to have the one piece um, facing away from the keyboard so now you insert the um, oh also um, you can see that at the middle here it has almost at the middle it's more at the top um, it has two sticks in the middle so yeah that goes up don't put it down like that so there you go now you know the position for that and what you do is insert this third piece underneath the black single bar at the top like that now you simply push um, the uh, black the third piece down and you kinda wanna put your nail in there so that 
you can stretch the white bar down in order for the piece to go underneath the white bar. Now all third all three pieces are just one. And what you do is you put the um, white part where the cave is and the black uh stick that's at the bottom now that's going to go into the holes that you can just slip something in. You put them uh, right in place and then you just push down on the other side. Make sure you hear a click and push down you know fairly uh, hard on it so that you can just be sure to that it's all the way in because sometimes it clicks but it's not all the way in so now you get your key, uh, you put it right in the center and push down evenly on all four sides. You'll feel a click, but make sure to feel, you know, tap it around a bit. And there you go.